Hey. So, uh, this is kind of a, I'm making it rain, right? So this is kind of in response, Critical K, uh, or K Marie, to your video. Uh, you posted about uh, basically panhandling uh, on YouTube um, and talked uh, a lot about Frankie and his feud with Go Lightly. And K, it's just, just, you don't have the right to put this poor man down. And even if he's going through hell and he's, he may not be making the best of decisions, that's okay because he's going through that. He needs compassion, love, and support to lift him up. He doesn't need somebody going on and laughing at him because he put maybe duct tape on his hood. And this is hearsay. And hey, hey everyone. So I'm here making it rain. So, uh, it's okay. Let's talk about your video really quick about mod, mod, you know, like panhandling on YouTube and everything. First, get off your high horse. Uh, you know, people work hard, and if people want to donate super chats to them, more power to them. As long as they're using their platform uh, in a responsible way, get off your high horse. Okay, I mean, I'm sure you get paid, right, for for the hospice. I mean, you're getting paid to basically, you know, like care for dying people. You know, so you're making profit off of death. So, I mean, and I'm not, you know, saying it's not important, but let's just be real, okay? And I don't know if you get donations from, you know, subscribers or whatever, but I think as creators, we put a lot of time and effort and we should, you know, if people want to donate, let them donate and don't make, give them a hard time. And certainly don't go... They, the audio went out, so what I'm saying in this is that you go on about panhandling and lump, you lumped Frankie Ruzchak in that, saying that he was basically compared him to a, a grimy bum because he was getting donations off of his sister's death, and it's like, so what? Like, people want to donate when to people that have lost loved ones, and even if they wanted to give him a cheeseburger, give him $5 for a fucking cheeseburger, let it be. Get off, get, get, just stop. Like he has lost one of the greatest loss of his life, his family's life. Get over it, leave him alone. And then you talk about Chris though. The, and you know why he killed them is because he is an evil monster and he was having an affair and he was uh uh with another woman and some in the butt, okay? So he wanted a new life. Bottom line, there is no excuse, okay? So stop trying to excuse him. He wasn't kind, okay? And yeah, it's like, oh, he was kind because he gave his paycheck away. Well, he wanted to... So like I said, you know, he was having an affair. Chris was having an affair. The evil monster was having an affair. And, you know, because, oh, but heaven forbid, Shanann left for a few weeks. He was a man, baby. He needed to be burped, you know, after meals, you know. But no, I mean, he was... He was out of control and he wanted a new life, okay? He discarded his family like trash. But now the root checks are having to know the horrid details of Bella saying, please don't do that to me, daddy. Don't kill me, okay? And I mean, the Watts family, they get to see their son. Yeah, he may be in prison because he made the decision to slaughter his family, uh, but they get to see him. The root checks don't. They have suffered a loss beyond a loss. So please leave them alone and just stop attacking Frankie. Leave him alone. He needs help and support, okay? Please, just get off of that high horse, okay? And, you know, again, just if people want to make, if people,